over 300 health workers, including nurses and midwives in the Ashanti region, have already left the health sector to seek greener pastures abroad in the first quarter alone. This is taking a toll on health care delivery at facilities where these experienced professionals have left and have also created a gap in the sector. President of the Ghana Registered Nurses and Midwives Association, Perpetual Ofori Ampofo, highlights the challenge the trend is having on healthcare delivery across facilities. There are a lot of gaps in terms of many of the specialized units where uh, specialist nurses were working. Um, some places like critical care units, intensive care, emergency units, even on general wards. Um, it's a bit difficult and the stress is on those who are currently at the facilities and working. It means the waiting time will be increased Increase at the outpatient departments, on the wards, um, it also delays procedures and activities to be carried on on particular patients. She is thus calling on the government to urgently employ nurses who are still at home to fill the gap. We need more hands to do our work and therefore it's important that government employs the 2020 batch of nurses to come and support the work of our colleagues. They are in the thousands, thousands of nurses, diploma, degree, enrolled nurses or auxiliary nurses all together. Female nurses in most health facilities have for years grappled with the challenge of combining breastfeeding and childcare with their work. The leadership of the association mooted an idea to build an educational facility at the Konfanochi Teaching Hospital where nurses drop their children and leave for work. Within the public sector, um, as a female employee, you are entitled to three months maternity leave. And therefore, when you give birth, uh, you have your three months. If you are lucky, you could have left your annual leave. You add it to it, it gives you about four months. By four months, you have not been able to achieve your six months breastfeeding, which means that you may be introducing certain feeds to the baby, which may not be too adequate because the child will be lacking the breast milk. And therefore, our predecessors here in the Ashanti region found it needful to have a place like a crèche or a kindergarten where those babies can be left whilst their mothers are in the hospital working and periodically they can come and breastfeed them. Or if they have somebody taking care of the child, they can focus on their work and do it. So they started it as a crutch, and you can see the facility has developed to KG1, KG2, class one, up to class six as we have it here. We have been able to complete this project to give room for junior high secondary school. So um, the future vision, is to have an SHS and also have even a tertiary level education. The association also called on the government to address issues relating to the 13th month allowance of its members. The Ghana Registered Nurses and Midwives Association is urging the government to expedite processes to employing the 2020 batch of nurses to ensure healthcare delivery is catered for. Half is to journey. City News, Kumasi, Ashanti Region.